Well, we've recently had funding from the Sprint Programme, which is a funding stream to allow space universities to work with SMEs. And we're working with a UK-based arm of a Spanish satellite propulsion company. So our valve is basically been evaluated and developed so that it'll work inside their system to allow them to use water as a propulsion system for satellites. So this has never been done before, mainly because they haven't had the tools to do it. And our valve is a key part to that solution. Okay, so this is an incredibly small device, um, which we patented the mechanism at the Open University. Um, the unique thing about it is it can store very high pressure gases on one side, and all the actual internal parts, all the wetter materials are inert, so we can actually control um, quite nasty corrosive gases without any degradation at all to the valve. The valve has other applications, um, not just in the space field, because um, again, anywhere where we need to store gases at high pressures, this valve can be used. It's lightweight, it's fast actuating, and the materials in it are very inert, so it makes it very attractive to other applications. So we've had a lot of feedback from satellite propulsion uh, manufacturers, in particular a company called AVS, who are an SME based in Harwell, who are uh, part of a Spanish company, um, and they are developing a revolutionary new way of controlling satellites by using water instead of hydrazine. So this could really change uh, the way that we do this for all satellites in the future.